everyone, welcome to our fourth stationary haul. It's been a hot minute since our last one, but if you want to watch our previous ones, you can watch them with the links down below in the description. Um, we're just going to jump right into this because it's a long one. Um, the first things that we got were from Ichiban Living. If you haven't seen our Ichiban Living shop with me, we'll also link that down in the description down below. Um, hopefully we're going to have an updated one out soon, but we shall see. <laughs> um, so a lot of the memo pads in Ichiban Living come with three designs. If it's not three different designs, it usually comes with three different colors. As you can see with this perfume bottle, it comes with pink, yellow, and then this teal kind of greeny blue color. Um, a lot of them come with different colors at least, but some of them actually come with different designs. So you can see here with the cupcakes, it's just different colors in the back. But with this next one here, it comes with different designs, which comes with uh, orange marmalade, strawberry jam, and kiwi fruit, which I think is super duper cute. Um, this one too comes with different designs, evaporated milk, which turns into coffee, and then it turns into mustard. So um, depending on, I think, the manufacturer, it comes with different things. If you guys have been on our channel for a while, you'll know that we have almost every single animal possible in this design. And we saw the bear and the penguin one, so we had to pick these ones up. We have like 10 other animals, but you know, stationary hoarders do what stationary hoarders gotta do. So the next one is just flower wreaths. I think the design actually differs a bit here on the outside, which I think is really cute. And it also does come in different colors. Here is um, a van and what it says on the side and like the designs actually differ a little bit here too. So I think that's really cute. We got suitcases. Um, I think this one is different colors, but the same design. And then we also got these food ones. These ones don't have different designs, but I mean, they're so cute. They're just pancakes and donuts and stuff. So can't not get those. <laughs> The next things that we got were, or actually one thing we got was from Michaels, and this is actually a brand I think that's by Michaels, I'm not exactly sure, but it's called Artist's Loft. Usually they do a lot of more affordable um, art goods for like dupes, I guess. This one's a pretty good dupe for Tombos. They look almost exactly like Tombos, and they work almost exactly like Tombos. So on one end you have the standard bullet tip bullet nib <laughs> and the other side is your standard like brush pen that looks exactly like Tombow's. Um, the bullet nib I would say writes a little thicker than 0.7 and then the brush pen is really really similar to Tombow as you can see here. Um, yeah not much complaining actually it's actually really good. Uh, as you can see you can draw a really thick line and really thin line as all brush pens should be. So the next things that we got were from Ichiban Living as well, and they're decor paper and letter paper. And you will see here, um, the letter paper looks like decor paper, so one side is just completely like decorative, and then the other side you can see is lined. We really enjoy these because they're like origami sized and they're really compact. You can put them in smaller envelopes, which is really nice. Um, because we're extra, again, we bought four different packs because, you know, gotta collect everything, right? So, at the top is the same design on every single sheet, but it's different per pad, obviously. So, <laughs> we got four of those. The next things that we got um, are design papers, and they come with four different designs as well. Each pack that we got comes with a varying, varying amount of paper inside. The first one we got, as you can see, is 48. This one only comes with 24. This one comes with 36, and I believe the rest that we got were like 48 or so. Um, but each one comes with four different designs. Um, my camera could not focus for some sort of reason on the first view, so unfortunate, but they're all cute. <laughs> so the next category of stuff that we got are actually from a convention that we went to not too long ago, which is called Otakuthon. It was back in August, and it's an anime convention that we went to in Montreal. Um, I went a little ham, and I bought a whole bunch of stuff from the artist alley. So these washi tapes are from the Artist Alley. Um, I was really stupid and I didn't get any of their business cards so I actually don't know who drew what, which is unfortunate, but I will do that the next convention I go to. So this first category is just a bunch of uh, characters. I had some Animal Crossing, some from Attack on Titan, there was Maple Story, etc. Um, these ones are just like miscellaneous cute ones. Um, Al is actually here because I forgot to put him in the, categ uh, the characters category, but that's fine. <laughs> These are all really beautiful. 
Here's some Studio Ghibli ones, and then this is a whole pack from one artist. All the other ones were from varying artists. I just kind of picked up stuff as I went along Artist Alley, but this one was so beautiful. I had to get the full set. So here it is in all its glory. The next category I got were um, postcards and like prints. The first one was actually from a restaurant I got. I just thought it was really funny. Um, and then I just chose these from varying booths. I just kind of went with what I thought was pretty. As you can see, um, they're all really pretty. Um, there's Lucio. I'm really annoying with Lucio on Overwatch. You don't want to play against me on Elios. <laughs> uh, so that last one is a bookmark that I actually got for free because I bought like way too many pins. So she was like, have a free bookmark. <laughs> The last thing here is just a pouch that someone actually gifted to me. I'm probably going to use it for pens and stationery stuff. I thought it was really cute. wanted to share it. So that's it for the stationery haul. Um, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in our next one. Goodbye!